Why Do Guys with Usama and Dylan. guy who like goes on <laughs> ped- like podcasts and like defense pedophilia you know but like in a looking like this no i'm just a philosopher a pe- i'm a, a pedoph- professor you know in old cultures they I'm were 16 year olds getting married don't put that on me <laughs> that's a real bad way yeah. i have to commit to this look for at least like 10 minutes and that's what i'm saying the look is no it's no, the guy no who like theorizes about pedophilia and why it's okay no, it's just the guy that just is esoteric. Okay, <laughs> I'm learned. Learn the word esoteric first. Yeah, we'll, we'll no, but I say esoteric <laughs> because et- just, etymologically, it's it's, uh, it's Atlantic pronunciation. You know, like Stella Adler. Stella Adler used to talk in a certain way. A like certain the, way. Yeah, it's the transatlantic, transatlantic, yes, accent, and it was done because it was for white people <laughs> who are, grew up Protestant, and they said fuck black people. <laughs> That's the whole you base gotta, of the accent. You got to make it. Men interested in learning facts. <laughs> got, we welcome to MILFs. Men <laughs> interested in learning, learning facts. facts. I am one of your hosts, Dil- Professor <laughs> Dylan, Dylan E. Dylan J. J. Paladino. Paladino. He came Italian. This is my savage friend. <laughs> <laughs> this is my unlearned <laughs> savage friend. Today we're going to talk about Rudyard Cup. Kipling's <laughs> The White Man's Bird. The best <laughs> author pretty much of our day. How Ricky Tiki Tavi was an allegory for brown monkeyhood. <laughs> <laughs> it was, though. All right, I gotta take this off. Fuck it. Got you, bro. <laughs> Get out I of was there. having fun, but <laughs> now, now everyone is gonna eugenics see professor. me as racist guy. <laughs> You know that mRNA is slower than the average white mRNA. Now I'm just going to be the guy that created phrenology or whatever. Oh, yeah. Um, what phrenology? You mean the study of the kidney bumps cells? On, no, there was uh, not free, not like phrenology was this. Oh, that's, uh, that, that's nephrology. Sorry. Phrenology is what? Uh, the study of bumps on your head. And, and oh, how, my and, God. And Vaughn they, spelled it with an F. <laughs> <laughs> no, but he got it right. It was used as like it was a, a, a racist study used to like. Bitch. basically uh, explain why certain races oh. weren't as bad as, or weren't as good as That's white people. fucking fascinating. They would be like, oh, the bumps in your head indicate how smart you are in IQ. And Just then, dumb shit people would try to use to justify subjugating a people. That's insane. That's crazy. I remember learning about it in, in uh, psychology. In, in school? I remember my dad oh. teaching me it when I was five. <laughs> um, no. I remember learning about it in, um, no, we learned about how it was a pseudoscience. Right. Uh, and being like, that's, Crazy. That's crazy because I also remember learning and then feeling because it's, yeah. it's based on this like bump in the back sure. that everyone has and just being like, oh, like, does this mean, is, does this mean anything? Like, wow. Would they have thought I was smart or dumb? Wow. It's crazy. Yeah. Pseudoscience, which involves uh, the measures, measurement of bumps in the skull to predict mental traits based on the concept of the brain is the organ of the mind. Yeah, no, it's dumb. Nice. Um, That's so dumb. It's crazy. Cranium. Nice. Wow. What cranium nice? What do you mean? No, I just haven't seen that word in a while. Oh, cranium. You know what? You're right. You know? I've no one's like uses like you know you know how sometimes you'll look mm-hmm. at uh, they'll show like the Google use of a word and some of them were like there's a bunch of words that were used right. in the 1800s that no one. I, I kind of want to go and see the words they used in the 1800s and then just try to bring them back because I've always wanted to mm-hmm. create slang. Like whenever I learn a new slang, I go, "Oh, it's fucking sick!" Like why can't yeah. I be the guy? That came up with a cap, whatever it was. Sure. Which do you know the uh, like the etymology of cap? No. What is this? So like someone's like no cap or like that's cap. Yeah, yeah. What about it? It it came from because I looked it up because I'm a, like I was like where, where did this come from? Yeah, yeah, Trying yeah. to oh slang is so cool. Etymology. Yeah, exactly. Of on God. Is, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. What's the etymology yeah, of, of this BVE? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and it's like in 1452, a Dutch sailor yeah, yeah. said, "Sending me." It's, you know, it's sending. <laughs> Sending me where? Send, sending me to the Isle of the Lapis. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's based on, cap is based on um, when people get gold caps put on their teeth uh, um, instead of getting the full gold tooth. So when someone would get a full gold yeah. tooth, it'd be like they had a lot of money because they could pay for the tooth. Dude, I but love some that. people who were cheap or were like poorer, they would just get the cap 
So when someone was like, fake. that's cap. Exactly. That's oh, fake. I'm like way too excited. <laughs> fake. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Someone would be like, oh, Easy. that's cap. That's a fake tooth. That's, that's amazing. Not real. A real gold tooth is the entire tooth. That's amazing. Yeah. Wow. It makes perfect sense. You go, oh, wow. But like the, the creation of it, you go, oh. But you want to, but you also want to go like, who is the first person to be like, that's fucking cap. You're capping right now. That's very interesting that, that there's always like a very interesting person who probably creates. Yeah. You know, like in a hundred years, they'll be like, I guess a black man was sitting yeah. and they saw a car explode and was like, sheesh or something. Like <laughs> and then that, that was the beginning of shit. I don't know. I, th- I found that very fascinating as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Etymology always fascinates me because if you keep going etymology, like there's gotta be one person at the beginning to have said this. To have created all this. There has to, yeah, you have to track down the first person that said. People say Shakespeare cat. created a lot of words. He did create. Like elbow a, or a, something is just Shakespearean word. Really? Uh, you, uh, elbow Shakespeare. <laughs> elbow Shakespeare. Is like, Elbow is a constable. A what man. does elbow mean? Oh, oh, uh, no, we. Oh shit! Need I don't it know. To Never f- mind. Do, would you actually? You can just look up. Um, oh wait, the noun elbow finds what uh, its origins yeah, yeah, yeah. six hundred years before Shakespeare. Oh, okay, gotcha. Got gotcha, gotcha. But look up like words Shakespeare created. Please. Yes, yes, yes. Um, there we go. First thing, because yes. this is also the thing that you, yes. in your English class. Yes, they, boom. They, ah, bandit. But those critic. Dauntless. No way. Dwindle. No oh, way. elbow as a verb. Oh. Ah, so you were close. Oh, to elbow someone. Yeah, green eyed. That's oh, badass. Oh, describe jealousy. That's badass. That's crazy. That's cool as hell. Lackluster. What? Swagger. He created swagger. He skim milk. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> then who made two percent? What a weird. <laughs> what a weird. What? What if the? Oh, what, so what if the truth is just he was like in his time. Just hanging out with like a bunch of cool black dudes, <laughs> and then he just took their terms and put them in his plays. And because they yeah. like they weren't allowed to go watch the plays, they never yeah. knew that he was just stealing I, from I them. I want to read that line. It was like, "Thou dost have yeah. much swagger." Yeah, swagger. Yeah. I'm like, you didn't come up with that. Yeah. That was a loser. black guy named Hercules or something. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, to walk or strut with the defiant or insolent air. Yeah. Swagger wow. is, is tight. Damn. I fucks with this. Yeah. I fucks with this. I f- Thou doth fucks with his? Thou dost have swagger. Mistress, quickly, if he swagger, let him not come here. No, by me, faith, I must live among my, my neighbors. neighbors. I'll know swaggerers. Okay, getting a little close. Hard yeah. ER on the R- swagger. Yeah, hard ER. <laughs> no, hard ER on the swagger. Um, well, it's like the, the yeah. etymology of um, woman. People always go like... Yeah. Oh, women, they just added a W-O to men. Sure. But it's not. It's from Old English for whiffman. Well, yes, sure. And men just meant person. Sure. And whiff wasn't from wife. Wife whoa, meant whoa. like- Go uh, off, go off. It, it was just like a type of person because then there was another type of- Yeah, look up uh, etymology. No, Real quick, he hold made on. all the unwords because he was, he was lazy or some shit. <laughs> so he just made un instead of the thing. Shakespeare must have loved the prefix un, un. because he created a-, a Created or gave new meaning to more this than lazy 300 bitch. words. Unaware. This lazy bitch. But also, who, no one else had thought about that before? That's amazing, dude. No, What did they say before? Undress. Take off the Take, dress? Like, it was yeah. all. Remove my clothing? What was it before zero? You see what I'm saying? Like, before it, it yeah. was nothing. Yeah. Yeah? Um, uh, etymology, E-T-Y, E-T-Y, He's yeah, etymology an of a uh, woman. Because it's like Whiffman, and then knave was used to refer to- Oh my God, you're fucking right. Yeah. Uh, old English Whiffman, see man, a female member of the. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so hold on, wait, wait. No, go back to etymology. This is this is not uh, dated. Um, no, go forward. Sorry, Jesus. Um, but it was like m- m- mon uh. was meant person, and then man sure, was sure, like sure. knave or something. Yeah, Wolfman. Um, but if you go back to all of it, it's like uh, yeah, go to that that first um, wife man. What? <laughs> no, but go to yeah. Uh, uh, there you go. Okay. Adult female human. Yeah. Whiffman, plural women, literally meaning woman, man, alternations of whiffman. Um, well, it's still coming from man, it seems like. Uh, no, because you know? man meant human being. Because right. so there like, was this guy, um, uh, what is his name? John McWhorter, who's a linguist who talked about it. And it's like uh, man would just meant person. Sure. And so there was like a whiffman and then a something other man, which meant a guy. 
And then like you, you na- keep, there was a the na- same fact. There yes. was a nave nave men, which meant like a child. Okay. So there are okay. all these different things. Sure, sure. It's pretty interesting. Um, it's all in Chaucer's Canterbury Tales or some bullshit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And it's all one black guy probably who's been saying all this shit. All this cool shit, yeah. And here's it. I'm telling you. But also- Elvis Presley stole all this shit from black guy. I'm sure Shakespeare yeah. heard- I'm telling you, he definitely stole it from a black dude. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He was like, he's like, you're undressing. And Shakespeare was like, yeah. oh, I've never heard, heard that, that before. You're yeah. so say, say cool. It say it again. You're and he's, so- like, he's like, the guy's like, <laughs> motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> oh, duh. You're so cool. He goes- Amazing. Okay. Now tell nobody we hang out. <laughs> you can't tell anybody we hang out. Where are you going? I will be back. I, I'll be back. It's twilight. Yeah, you exactly. Will, you said yeah. you were going to bring me, like, maybe help me out. <laughs> Shoot. Because he needs to create them. <laughs> Thank you for your services. I love you. I love thee. <laughs> I love thee. <laughs> I'm um, 100% sure a black guy made these. Done. Yeah. Etymolo- oh. Etymology is pretty tight when you like look into all this stuff. Of course. Of course, dude. I, it's it's always interesting. I mean, dude, we talked about this. Juggernaut is a yeah. Sanskrit word. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of them. Yeah. Jug- yeah. Thuggy. Thug was a cool thug, one. Thug. Thug life. Um, of course. I was looking at- Can you, uh, can you, can you write uh, uh, well, uh, English words that derive from Sanskrit? Probably a lot of them. Let's see. From Not Sanskrit. Latin. Not Latin, bitch. Not Sanskrit's today. older than Latin? You got it. Hey, yo, go back. You there you go. There you go. It's a tough one. It's a tough one, Franz. Juggernaut, oh, karma, karma fine. Zen, chicken tikka masala. Okay, Ayurveda, of course. Yoga. Let's go to some, okay, come on. Come let's on. Go to some cooler ones that yes. no one knows. Karma. karma, Zen. Oh, actually, I thought Zen was Zen. Japanese. No, it's not. Okay. Well, Buddhism started in India. Buddhism was invented in India. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Buddha was there. Yeah. Uh, let's keep see going. Keep going down, please. <laughs> Look at the ads you're getting. Yeah. No, no. Oh but he was God. he was doing something oh. before. <laughs> I don't want to say because it's going to ruin the surprise for yeah. someone. But um, yeah, for suitcase. Uh, keep going. Let's see. <laughs> Ashtanga. Yoga, I don't even know what that blah, is. Blah blah blah. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Vinyasa. Bindi. Keep going. Bindi. Orange. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Orange originated in Sanskrit, referring to the citrus fruit and the color. Naranja. Oh. Wow. Oh, and Naranja is a span. Oh, wow. Wow. Man- Mandarin. Okay. Whoa. Racist. Punch. Love- what? Wait, what? Oh, a beverage consisting of oh. wine spirits. Oh, my. Yo, 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 yo. Punch means, punch means five in Hindi. What in the world? Wait. Punch is made without booze. Five ingredients used what? for traditional punch. What? Mixies? Uh, <laughs> you guys were making jungle juice back then. Oh, don't call it jungle juice. <laughs> wow. Wow. Jungle juice, huh? Maybe I'll wash it down with some uh, monkey spirits. Huh? That's not what I said. Wow. Take, <laughs> a, know, take a monkey shot. You know, huh? I almost didn't say it, but I wow. was like, I'm going to give this to some. <laughs> wow. Okay. Thank you, Nigga. And I don't know if I'm playing into your. I'm, I mean, it's terrible. Put the glass back on. <laughs> the savages and the jungle juice. <laughs> God, I didn't say it with these on. Um, yeah. Oh, pun- okay. So punch is because it <laughs> means five. And alcohol, wow. sugar, lemon. I'm gonna water, use that to spices. get laid later. I'm gonna use that to get yeah, laid. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, 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 I'm gonna be at the punch. Hey, you know, uh, punch actually uh, in the word. Right? It's from my uh, my culture. Candy. Because they used to mix it with juice soda. Oh, and then word comes from Sanskrit, kandaka, which means sugar candy. Oh, yeah, loot, I know, yes. Kanda means peace. Oh, kanda means peace, okay. Wow. Pretty cool. Wow. We learn a lot of good stuff. Avatar, Avatar yeah, the cheetah. Blah, blah, blah. Yes. Hey, cheater. jungle comes from... <laughs> 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 so I was actually <laughs> using a Sanskrit hey, word. It says, tur- used- <laughs> it says turban head is a... <laughs> Actually, from India. That's so crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm using your words. <laughs> jungle juice. You know, it's also offensive to say jungle gym now. You say the structure. The structure. Yeah. Apparently, jungle is like <laughs> sounds two like an A24 athlete. movie. <laughs> yeah. Bro, apparently it's too jungly. Like it's like uh, savages on on but trees. Who's and just, thinking that? Bro, I'm not me. That's uh, crazy. My my brother's girlfriend was in uh, Thanksgiving and and uh, jungle she was gym like, offensive. Maybe uh, offensive. Yeah. Yeah. Serious question is Heather. Really? Let's let's see what Heather. What is Heather? Th- Heather let's think. see what Heather on Twitter thinks. <laughs> We've got to see who Heather is. Um, zero likes. Dome wow. climbers. <laughs> Wait, what? Dome climbers Dome seems more. Dome racist. climber is like an actress who wants to really make it. You know what I'm saying? So she does whatever she needs. Dome to. climbers is. Re- She's yeah. a dome climber. She'll just suck whatever. Okay, go to the racist term WordPress. Um. I've heard yeah. Jungle Gym called by many other names. I've heard them called play sets, swing yeah, sets, yeah. playground equipment. Um, a good friend 
said he was watching CNN. The woman they interviewed took <laughs> underbridge. At this point, they're just trying to find yeah, things to be upset yeah, with because yeah. no one actually cares because she said that it was a racist phrase. You know, you know what phrase we're never going to drop? What? Is uh, gung ho. We love that one. Is that racist? It's Chinese as fuck, dude. <laughs> Is it just Chinese words? Yeah. Gung ho. Gung <laughs> Gung. Oh wait, look up. What's wrong look, with that? Just, wait, wait, look it's up. Nothing. But I think we're saying it's literally Chinese. We're saying literally Mandarin. Oh, it originated during the second uh, yeah. Sino-Japanese War from a Chinese yeah. term, short for Chinese industrial cooperatives. Yeah. Oh, it, it's from the Chinese Gunghe. I don't know how to say Gunghe. it. Gunghe. Gunghe. Taken to mean. Oh wait, will you look up uh, Gunghe Chinese? See if we can get the pronunciation. Yeah. Um, Gunghe pronunciation. Gunghe. Whoa. Wow. Uh, just Chinese people don't want to be known. There you go. Gung yeah. uh, uh, gun oh, over, it, it's a, it's a gun ho. It gun originated yeah. from Chinese. Gong he. Gong he. Uh, maybe yeah. go pronunciation. Gong he. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Go on, go on, go on. Right there, go on. It's Chinese. Gong he means pronounced gong he right there. Work together. Yeah, gong he. Okay. Gong he, yeah. So, I mean, that's not... No, it's not. But you, it's next. It's next on the chopping block. Probably someone will be like, "You can't say gung ho yes, anymore." You're using, you're using another language. Okay. Yeah. Exactly. Um, wow. I love gung ho. No, now it's just going to be a uh, gung ho. Fucking... Okay. Oh, she's wow. Kind of sexy. Yeah, wait, was it? Is it again? We did. We did this already. Bro. Yeah. Just... <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. Old school. Why do guys there? Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, we've been <laughs> riffing for 30, for 30 minutes. <laughs> on, on etymology. <laughs> um, oh, I wanted to do this question. Is it? Um, that's enough facts for today. Um, we're just men interested in learning facts. We're just facts. men interested in learning facts. Oh, okay. Hell yeah, thank you. Um, okay, so we got a question, guys. Remember to send in your questions to why do you guys podcast at gmail.com or go to my link tree or Usama's. Right. There's a form submission there. Send in your questions. You can you can put a different name. We will not put your, use your real name. Completely fine. Like today, we got an, an anonymous one. That's good. Um, they said, question, um, how do I date? I'm attempting to avoid an arranged marriage. I'm not totally against the idea, but I'm trying to figure this out myself. Background, I'm in my mid-20s, I have a good job, I'm introverted, but make an effort to be social. I'm well-liked at church, work, but can't seem to get any dates. I wouldn't say I'm the ugliest person alive, but would my current form warrant a double take? Probs not, I don't drink right now, and dating apps are scary. How do I find a boyfriend? Um... Would my Wait, current I don't get form what, I don't get what they're saying. take is the most poetic way to say I disgusting. But would my current current she uh, said but would my current form warrant a double take? <laughs> oh, 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 she's saying I'm not ugly no, no, yeah. but I'm also not hot enough yes. to where someone goes like, "Oh shit." Obviously, yeah. Oh, I thought you were saying a double take like, "God damn, they're fucking ugly." <laughs> <laughs> You've seen those people where you walk by and you go, "Holy fuck." You see that person? <laughs> And you feel so bad. That's amazing. <laughs> you did <didn't bump> it. <laughs> God, we're like, oh, fuck. Yes, they're ugly. Jeez. Wow. Sometimes, listen, <laughs> that's why whenever you like look at your face a little bit and be like, am I, there are people out there with some stuff going on, some yeah. growths and shit. Like, and like shit. you have the worst life, 100%. And those are the guys who have the Instagram that's like all inspirational quotes. Like, it's all about, it's like, oh, God. It's not all about that. But they're just like, go to the gym. Dude, just get your Because they're improving snatched. below the neck. Yeah. Um, how do I date? Uh, when they said arranged marriage, I'm not going to lie, I thought maybe they were Indian. Right. Well, there's um, some, a Christian can be Indian. If you're Malu, you know, or you're okay. South Indian, there's a lot of Christians there. Um, so we don't know. Or it could be like a Christian arranged marriage, which I think they That's don't happen creepier. as much, but they do. That's even creepier. Yeah, why is it creepier? Because it's in our culture. It's not in the culture. Yeah, you're right. So when they're doing it, you're doing it, it outside. And the, it feels kind of like culty. Yeah, 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 where, yeah. yeah, whereas just like in Indian culture, it's very natural. It's and, chills out, yeah. And like usually works out better than regular marriages. Um. Let's see. I have, I have a good job. I'm introverted. How do I date? Dating okay, apps, first okay, of all, when people say okay, dating hold, apps hold are scary. Hold on, hold on. Before we even go, go jump into this, dude. Yeah. Yeah, honey, you get some self confidence needs to get in there. Yes. The war on do a double take was such a powerful lie. Like, dude, you hate yourself. Yeah. And, yeah, you do. Enough. Enough of that. Love yourself. Go yes. work out. Go. Anytime I hate myself, if I do a little workout, do I feel yes. great? I feel hot. You're like, I'm trying. I'm doing better. Yes. Uh, it feels like it doesn't matter if you're hot or not. You're doing something to better yourself. You're improving yourself. Go out there. Every day you're doing something. Work out. Work out. Trust me. Yes. I I'm a, I used to hate working out. Oh, you hate it. 
And I started doing it once a week, twice a week. Once a week. Once a week. Once a week. Half a week. <laughs> once every two weeks. But regardless, he's doing it. He's doing trying it. to get into. And I feel great. I feel great. I'm going to yes. go, I'm going to go work out. It first. always feels, you always feel better when you do it. You yeah. feel better about yourself. Even if it's starting with like a 15 minute walk and then every now and then you do some jumping jacks in the corner, yeah. like whatever it is. Um, no one, like everyone's always like, oh, I don't want to look stupid or whatever. Yeah. I'm telling you right now, whenever I see someone working out ever, I'm always, I always get inspired. Even if it's oh, the yeah. smallest thing, I go, fuck yeah, dude, they're working out. Oh, like yeah. even I saw this girl the other day, her face was red. She was running. Yeah. She was not running fast. I could yeah. tell it was really hard for her, but I was still like, good dude, for her, dude. dude nothing makes good me like, more, for her. like soulfully turned on than uh-huh. seeing like a hot girl running on the, in yes. the treadmill. I'm like, you are earning. Yeah, you're going for it. Every, every yes. day. Every double take. Yeah. I want you ever, <laughs> God damn, uh, you're ugly. Damn, you're- <laughs> but, Dude, like that's hot. Yeah, you yeah. are hustling for your body. Oh, yeah, I would say, dude. You, first of all, like, um, have confidence in who you are as a person. It's not just like your looks. Usama and I can both attest to it. There have been women we've met who are not like, who don't maybe warrant a right. double take. But then you meet them. They have a lot of confidence. Dude. They they like, and it's so sexy and hot. Listen, that you have had. I've had more fun with them than oh, I have with a oh, lot of hot girls. Oh, oh, I'll fuck them all. <laughs> What? What? Wait, I'm being feminist. No, I know. <laughs> yeah. But I was like trying to make a point. And you're just like, yeah, I'll fuck anything that moves. Yeah. <laughs> That's a more gruff way of saying what you're saying. No, what I was <laughs> saying was like the people in my life who I remember the most, like the girls that I've uh, like had even like a couple no, no, of month relationships with. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm I know joking. you are. I'm joking. But you're like those those women, they were not like the double take ones, but mm. they had their own interests, were confident in themselves, oh, had yeah. fun. And I was Good. like, this was always so much more fun than the hottest girl you hook up with so i yeah. want to say she definitely has a lot more to offer than i think she's providing get some confidence she's yeah. in her mid-20s she has a good job yeah. See, already that's great you're introverted amazing find someone else that wants to stay at home and do whatever or every now and then mm. you go out and be social not everyone needs to be social it doesn't and we should do it send us your picture and we'll fucking build you up because <laughs> yes, we will yeah you're right yeah um i don't unless like, you're really just fucking disgusting i don't drink right <laughs> now i don't know what that means um, oh, yeah, like socially, right? Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's uh, fine, I really but it's, it's a little tougher, you know? Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, dating apps are scary. I don't, look, I know people say this. I don't right. think dating apps are scary. I think they're only scary if you think they are. I was right. talking to one of my girlfriend's friends this weekend, and she was like, I don't want to do apps yet. Like, it's scary. What am I going to do? And I go, that's all in your head. Yeah. I go, if you just go on it and you talk to someone or you don't, it's not a big deal. Like, you're not in danger, yeah. actually. I know you're going to meet some weird people. But you're not in danger. Mm. You can very easily block, report, or exit. Just yeah. don't have, like, you're not in danger unless you put your address on there. Yeah. And it's not scary. I think it's scary for you because you're putting yourself out there and it's the idea of, oh, are people rejecting me all day long and I don't even see it? But, dude, just, like, just do it. A little bit of tough love. Uh, just do just it. Just do it. There. Yeah. And I just, you know, self-love is it makes everything better. Everything. Yeah. I'm not a, well, why, also, why do you think you are going to have an, an arranged marriage? She says, I'm not against the idea. So, like, um, your parents, you didn't explain that at all. Yeah, it's she like did, She didn't explain it, yeah. So, what, what's the issue here? She goes, I'm well-liked at church, but I can't seem to get any dates. Yeah, but, I mean, no one's going to ask you out from church. Well, do people do that? This is, like, two different questions at one. Ask out. No, she's like, how do I date? It's very easy to date. Here's what I'll say. Dating apps, if not that, um, if you have friends... Try to go to go out to bars or whatever and just yeah. see if like a dude will talk to you. It's not the best place. Or like um, coffee shops are always a, a cool place to kind of sure. meet someone because sure. it's less stakes. You can see someone walk in. If it's a coffee shop they go to on the regular, maybe after the third or fourth time, mm-hmm. you can like try to flirt with them, see what's up. Just have a, get, have a date at a place where you're not facing someone. I, w- like I always movie? hate that. No, no, no. Yeah, maybe a movie. But I don't like... If, it, if it's a table, I hate the facing each other thing. Why? Because it's like an interview. You know what I'm saying? I like the idea of a table you're sitting um, on uh, adjacent sides. Because then you can actually connect more. Hold on, wait. Are you the person that if you have a booth, you sit on the same side as them? Not anymore because people are like... <laughs> yeah, it's horrible. Like, Stop. It's fucking but, horrible. But uh, I was like... Let me just saddle on in. And you know what I'm saying? Like, But I, I, I don't even do booths now. So I, I basically... Uh, you know, I have a table where I sit on the side where you have to sit on well, uh, like a uh, adjacent side because oh, the you. interview style is you just takes away the sexuality. Bro, you want a corner? Yeah, booths are 
Screaming. Yeah. <laughs> I'm screaming. I'm ranting. But booze can work because it's like more intimate. Yes, yes. But it's just like, bro, most booze are like, the table is like thick as hell. Yeah, yeah, so you're yeah. just like, they're playing paper football with the bitch. You know? The best is, uh, <laughs> paper football. It's just a long The best table. is the couch. If yeah. you're in a bar that has a couch with the table. Oh, you nice. dog. Yes. That's nice. Be- even better. You on the end of a couch, she on a plush chair right next to the couch. Yes. Now we're kicking. Now we got space. Now we're kicking. She got space, but she's like also does she nothing. She doesn't but feel like you're right next to her and it's weird. Yes. There should be no block. No block yes. between you and the person. Yeah, there's no block. Maybe the, the feet like brush by accident. Yeah. yeah, you get a little. No, it's nice. St. Ends. Just throwing that out there. St. Ends? In the city? That was some real game. Yeah. You guys right there. Anyway. Oh, oh, oh. I thought, I thought you were saying St. Ends like a bar in the city. It is. Oh, okay. I was like, well, hopefully she lives in the city. Yeah. Um, I, I think you, uh, here's how you date. Have more confidence. Believe in yourself. Yeah. And then go out and try to, t- just, you know what? Just t- try to talk to people. Yeah. People say this all the time. Dude, y- it gets easier every single oh, yeah. time you do oh, it. Yeah. I used to, I used to be very unconfident. I used to be very unconfident. Shakespeare, what's up? I used to be very. Yes. Unaware. Unaware. With my elbow in my face. I would Dude. be unable to undress. <laughs> And, you know, I, I treated confidence like a fucking set of skills to get better at, you know? That's how you- After every moment I would have a conversation, I'd walk away like, what moments in that conversation was I scared? And pinpoint those moments and try to be like, what, how can I make that less scared good. next time? Also, ask your friends if they have anyone to, like, hook you up with. Yeah. That's usually the easiest way. You're good. And even, I don't know, if someone at your church... I feel like you have options. Preacher? Think, yeah. Huh? The deacon? No, not. Those guys are always hustling, right? You know those, you know those like black preacher conventions are always like known for having like a bunch of STDs. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, like, come on down for the Lord. <laughs> you know, suck me off for the God, for Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Suck me off <laughs> for Jesus. Yes, bro. You think that's been said? Oh, 100%, dude. A hundred percent. I I've been talking to the Lord, and sometimes He wants I us wish, to feel good. Sometimes I wish I was more repressed because I feel like sex would be more fun. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, it definitely because is. I'm yeah. not. I'm like, this is great. I'm happy. I'm doing it. But if I like thought it was like bad and dirty, and I didn't want anyone to see, and then yeah. hid and turn all the lights off, and was like, no, we can finally do it. I feel like it would be awesome because I'm like, this is so wrong. That's why. That's why European sex probably sucks. You know, they're all just like laying there. Yeah, they're all and like, also like. Berlin is such a godless place, like such an atheist everywhere. <laughs> they have to actually have like public sex be legal so any they can feel something. You know, it's like such. Okay, I don't know what to do. I have okay. You can fuck as a supermarket, and then yeah. it's like okay, I'll, anything. anything. I, I can't do the uh, public sex. It doesn't. Dude, I, does, the, it, it doesn't work for me. Yeah, I, I know, know people that like it. That's like the. Um, you know, some people they they can get off because they're like that's it's wrong. Yeah, but then my nerd brain just goes like. Yeah, I'm going to get arrested. <laughs> and I go like, I'm going to be sitting in a jail cell like, this was not worth it. You know? Dude, dude. the number of Starbucks I've jacked off in. <laughs> and the, the, I, the On record. Dude, <laughs> if I'm out with a, with a girl back in the day, like I was always trying to fuck in the bathroom somewhere. Like Lower East Side. I have so many like bathrooms. How do you do it though? You just order a drink at the okay. bar, you know, and you just go to the bathroom. And then like two seconds later, you, you the girl gets up, she goes to the bathroom too. And you just open the door and you come in. How long are you in the bathroom for though? Because I and you always like, go to a place that has two bathrooms or two bathrooms. Okay, because you I never go like, to a single bathroom. Yeah, because I would I would be pissed. Yeah, yeah. If if anyone walked out, I'd be like, <laughs> two people walk out, motherfucker. <laughs> two people walk out. I go. I really had this shit. Now you're gonna shave in this jizz zone. Yeah, you know, like we are looking for the cum. You're like, where the fuck? I is go. The this cum? is a, this <laughs> is just disrespectful. It is. It is. I had to fucking poop really bad, <laughs> <laughs> and I've been waiting. I've never, I've never ran into someone doing that, but I've heard of people doing it, going sure. in bathrooms and stuff. It's also, it's, it's not made for me. I'm too Probably, tall. It's just doggy style over the sink, dude. Yeah. Yeah. It's simple. For sure. Yeah. Yeah. I fucked I've, I've in Pete's candy store once. Oh my God. And um, in the bathroom, the Williamsburg bar. Really? And it was a small one. That bathroom is so the small. The small one. So she was, I was like on the toilet seat. She was like uh, riding me on the disgusting. toilet seat. She was holding onto the sink. The sink was like fall. It was like the it was like breaking apart. We like leave it like there's like leakage in the sink. Like it was not okay. It was not okay, dude. We fucked up the piping. I couldn't even fit in the bathroom. So just, no. <laughs> That's why, like, I I have no. I don't care about ever joining the Mile High Club. I don't. It is, it's not even possible. It, for me, not possible at all. Also, like, it's just. That must have been, that was back when flight attendants were cool. Yeah. 
when they were called stewardesses. Oh yeah, <laughs> and they were school. Dude, there, now, who do you think ever banged in a bathroom? It's impossible. It's not. No, possible. but people do it. Yeah. Yes, but I think it was before. Again, when flight attendants were cool. Yeah. Now they'll like tape you to a seat if you if you breathe yeah. for too long. <laughs> yeah. If you just say, if you ask them what their name is, they're like, nah, it's yeah, enough. Yeah, yeah, stop. But uh, I, I mean, the, everyone sees you. Everyone has to see. Right. Maybe on like a super long flight, but the bathrooms are so. Here's what you have to do: you have to be in the last aisle row, the last row. All right, you and your girl, different aisles. Right, boom. I'm in C. You're in. You're in D. Right? Oh, okay. I go to the bathroom. Yeah. The stewardess is doing uh, food service. Yeah, you gotta. You have to really. You have to fucking Ocean's Eleven this show. Oh, shit. <laughs> There's bass music playing in the back. Yeah, you drop a credit card in front of <laughs> in front of the flight attendant. And they go to pick it up, and, and when they say "Sir," you've already walked by. You know that scene from uh, Ocean's Eleven where that Asian acrobat gets out of the cylinder. <laughs> That's what you have to do with your girl. She has to get out of the cylinder. You have to hire someone to dress up as your body double. And walk the other way when you bump you in. You call it a bomb threat. Yeah. <laughs> and the fucking... Dude, Ocean's Eleven. Has fuck. anyone here of listening ever joined the Mile High Club? And and if you have, like, write in. And if it was I've on a, a private jet, it doesn't count. You're That's right. just bragging. <laughs> That's just bragging. I've been in the Mile Low Club, which is a hand jump at a Greyhound. Oh, God. I've been there. That is, that's rock bottom, dude. Yeah. You know what rock bottom is? The guy who was next to you who watched it happen and was like, what do I expect? I'm on a fucking Greyhound. Like, <laughs> Greyhound's the most horrific Oh, experience. God. Yeah, I remember I was on a mega bus and I saw two people open a bottle of wine and pour it into solo cups and I went... <laughs> That's I mean, fun. That's cool. I know, but I went. I mean, I paid ten dollars for the, this ticket. What do I expect? Here's the danger, right? Sit in the back. You don't want to see have anyone behind you. That's dangerous. At a you have to be in the back. Greyhound etiquette. Other thing. There's gonna be a black lady who screams on the phone <laughs> for hours. That's just accept it. The, the sooner you accept it, the faster it's gonna go. She's gonna be screaming on the phone for hours. A lot of stuff to talk about. <laughs> a lot of stuff to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ is so um <laughs> I think a bus hand job could be kind of fun. It was it was fun. It was great. I got like half of one on a plane once. Oh yeah? And I was like, let's stop. Dude, I I, I was I like, got like nervous. Dude. I got like shy. I'm, <laughs> I'm like, I'm shy. I think an old guy just got arrested for <laughs> checking off next to a woman recently. Yeah. Didn't he? Go, old go, man go, go. <laughs> Old man masturbates plane. Old man and God. his C. God, this is the old guy I don't want to become. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Old guys either become cool or just the creepiest guys ever. All these ever. motherfucking dicks on this motherfucking Has to plane. be a Florida man. Of course. Elderly Florida man cops to masturbating on flight next to a 21-year-old woman. I mean, you just shouldn't sit a 21-year-old next to an old Dude, guy. Dude, this, this should be illegal. He can't help it. Uh, no, I mean, obviously it's next to a 21-year-old woman touching her uh, thigh. Oh. Whoa. Ew. Ew, dude. You disgusting fuck. Fucking disgusting. Oh, and it says his full name. God. Dude, Don, good. Donald Robinson. Oh, that sounds like a fucking that old sounds, comer. I can. Bonita Springs. Uh, oh, my God. And she she rec, uh, recorded a 24 second video. Uh, oh, 24 seconds? You couldn't get it in 2020? Oh, uh, How many seconds were just, were just for you, victim? Um, I'm sorry, guys. What a That's disgusting. gross he's, he's, piece he's, of shit. It's so. Hey, I mean, wait, wait, wait. The startled victim asked him what he was doing, and Robinson went silent and stared out a window for the remainder of the fight. <laughs> He's just like, you know what? I'm caught. No, he, he pretended. He tried to be like, what? Nothing? I'm not jacking up. He just stared out the window. I love mountains. Yeah. Okay. It's like when a kid gets I love, caught. I love clouds. No, it's like when a kid gets caught, and then they just pretend that they didn't do anything. They're like, yeah. if I just turn away, they'll forget what yeah. happened. Yeah. Wow. Uh, On United, too. The woman then typed out a message on her phone and held it up for a passenger to see. Oh, God. Look up Donald Robinson. Let's see what this fool looks like. Oh, boy. Donald Robinson. There's no way I'm going to be surprised. Oh, my God. Home Depot. Work. The New York Post is such a bad website. Dude, they, to really, they really come in, dude. Oh. No. No. No, no, no. It's not him. Hold on. Right there, right there, right there, right there. On no, the no. On the left, right? You know what's so Apparently funny? We can't find There him. has been multiple masturbating Donald Robinsons. <laughs> That's just one of those masturbating guys. Maybe they're just not going to show his face. Oh, oh geez, yeah. Geez. All right. Well, time for hinges, guys. Okay, <laughs> let's get out of here. And we have a Donald Robinson. Thanks for sending it we in. We can look at the criminal affidavit. Wow. <laughs> Is there quotes on it? Doesn't like, show his face. And though. then the assailant said, 
don't worry about it or something. Wait, go to conclusion. Let's see what they say. Conclusion, based on all of the foregoing, I submit that there is probable cause to believe that on... Okay, he did it. This shit is boring. Oh, flight 1663. Oh, he's going from Newark to Boston. That's a le- You can't just wait one hour? And he violated Title 49, Section 465. Of, like, there's like a penal code for jacking off next to someone on a plane. <laughs> God. Um, I love it. All right, I love cool. It. Two hinges. Jesus Christ, Donald. Donald, get it together. It's Donald Hinge. Yeah, it's Donald. Hey, guys, help me. Uh, what a tough time with women. Can I? Uh, let's it. do uh, Nikita. Let's do it. Um, oh, okay. Pause. I know, this, I know this girl. Do you know her? Do you not want to do it? <laughs> let's go for it. Let's do it. Uh, hookah girl at Mr. Hookah. Okay. What's happening? Uh, what an aggressive first photo. She's you look intense. pissed. She's like, always angry. Yeah, she's, but she's cool. She's very funny. Is she? She's got uh, the, the, the sliced eyebrow is always a scary thing. It's so scary. It for just a means girl. you'll kill somebody. I think. Yeah, but she looks cute. She looks cute. I, yeah, I guess it's really intense. That's it's intense. First photo, and then this right here Whoa, is Jesus. so intense. Nikita. Twenty six, and then it says her twenty six, and then it says her astrological whoa, sign. Whoa, and whoa, She likes ha. snowboarding, ha. soccer, actor, stand up, yeah, mom. Yeah. Recently out of an eight year relationship, hey. workaholic. Ha. I will get rich or die trying. Ha, the here emojis for, here for friends mostly, maybe a boyfriend ha. with intention to marry them. Demisexual, monogamous, <laughs> and hilarious. It's <sighs> it's, it's it's honestly <sighs> such an unhinged fucking. Bio. I want. Uh, Zodiac Killer, please. Zodiac Killer This vibes. is crazy to do. Oh, my God. No hookups ah. ever. Also seeking a oh new God. gym, bro. I can't, I can't. Nikki. Nikki. This is insane. Nikki, this is wild. Nikki. This is wild. This is absolutely this is insane wild. to put out there. Like, it's wild. Categorically insane. No hookups ever unless you're a gym, bro. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to change this. Okay. How about none of that? No guy who's looking for a relationship is going to be like, she seems cool. Listen, yeah. like 26? Surfer soccer. Like, don't, don't forget that. This, like, she immediately threw in, like, two passions. So good. Yes. 26, snowboarding She didn't soccer. do the uh, mass for actor. She wrote out actor. Actor, stand. Yes, you're right. It's so crazy. Mom. Also, tell me you were in an eight-year relationship. I will get Richard to have, like, Nikita. This is, like. I, I'm scared. Yeah. And I, I know this person. She's not that crazy. I don't know what this is. Maybe she's, like, being intentionally crazy. She's not that wild. Yeah, I anyway, don't know. Anyway, keep going. Like, get out yeah, of here. Maybe she, yeah, keep going. My stomach hurts. Um, my basics. My Here comes basics. another. Oh God! Okay. Active woman. Okay. Okay. Never smoked weed. <sighs> looking, it, but then it says looking for. Don't know yet. I just can't. My interest. Boxing. boxing. It's your first interesting boxing oh run. Oh my God! If your first interest is punching people. Wow, she speaks four languages. That's cool. Okay. That's the first cool thing about. Her. Very cool. <laughs> um, cute though. I, but like, still cute. barely smiling. Okay, yeah, and the smile is very sinister too. It's like yeah, like. What this? Oh God! What guy fucked you? Oh, I'm the eight year relationship. I guess. Uh, I feel for you. Ah! It's meant to be if you fund and or support all my bad decisions. Oh, I mean, what the fuck? And join, and join in. in. She's enjoy being my, intentionally weird. I think. Yeah, enjoy my weirdness. Laugh yeah. at everything I say. Make me laugh. Don't take life too seriously. And love pizza. I mean, it's a fun end. This pizza, is like so great. many different people. A conglomerate of. I mean, I think you think she's being intentionally weird. Yes. Yes. I think she's. I think she's troll. trying to get she's some trolling. weird sugar. She's, daddy. she's trolling us. You think? Perhaps. Maybe. Nikki, I'm, I'm on to you, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's like it's you a, spent yeah. your time making a fake profile. We'll, we'll see. Let's treat yeah. it as real. I mean, she already knows. Keep going. Uh, can we talk about the end slash? That's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> the, you're right. The end slash. And slash double. You fund and slash support what? Her in the gym, but it's like okay. not even no, the double. No, I mean, it's got some body. It's fine. It's got some body, legs, but like, it's got no, no. This is cool. Yeah, it's fine. A the, little bit of a better the, smile, but you still eyes. look kind of hurt, like you're hurt. Uh, do, um, <laughs> did Dylan, yeah. Not emotionally. That's, what's I, nice no, about it? Not emotionally. Ooh. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, sorry. What's <laughs> nice about it? So I'm, just, I'm so I'm just like I think she's just fucking with us. So I'm like, all right, I'm not gonna be <laughs> right, nice. Right, right. But okay, you know what? This is a nicer smile. Yes, you're showing it is teeth. a smile of some it sort. It is a smile. You know how to smile. Oh, yes. The <gasps> quickest way my heart is being my BFF first is the only way to my heart. Bonus points for feeding me, giving me attention, being super loyal, trustworthy, patient, funny, hot. Like a dog. Like a sexy dog. Is there anything else? Keep going. Just her with a knife. Yeah. <laughs> just a gun. You know, the only way to finish it would be a gun straight to the camera. That would actually... I, you I want think pizza? I, would, I yeah. think I would swipe right after yes. that. i go, okay, she's great. Yeah. Her smiling again in the same room with the same hat. Uh, oh, wait, so, uh, there's more. 
no, go down. No, no, it's, the same, it's the same. No, cool. Co- <sighs> a fun fact I'm obsessed with: cool cars, dudes with good beards or eyebrows. Ooh, who will spar with me? She wants, she wants to be sponged. And racing people on the I-84 at 2 a.m. after I get off work in Gresham. LOL. Vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom. This was written in, like, the midst of a manic episode. Like, first of all, vroom, vroom is the, like, Gen X skirt, skirt. You know what I'm saying? Like, the, yes. vroom, vroom. Yeah, yeah, vroom, vroom. You know what I'm saying? Like, swerve. Swerve. What is going on? Wow. Lives in Portland, I guess. Hey. Okay. Hey. Should have been earlier. Wow. That's that's body. And then she's wearing Playboy sweatpants. That's cute. Is there anything else? That's good. That, this, that's this, just, this is the that longest be, that, Bumble that, profile I've ever. Tie guard. Um, yeah. The last photo is great. Put it in the beginning. If you're trying to make this a good profile. Yeah, I don't know if you're trying to. Um, yeah, I mean, and, and then besides that, literally scrap everything else. Also delete it. Also delete your <laughs> Also, why is the same look, photo? Look, okay, same photo? On. Yeah, it is the same photo. Same. Same. Photo. It's all just like you took one. Dude. Why is your hand on the wall? I, I just don't understand. I, I really think she's fucking with us. I really do. Nikki. It's all the same photo. And you know her. Nikki. She's, on, uh, she's always like commenting on my videos and stuff. Like, uh, she's chill. But I didn't know. She looks so this upset so in the car. insane. Imagine that's the photo coming to pick you up. You're just like, oh god, I'm about to get uh, yelled seven. at. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm gonna get yelled at. Hey, so what do you want to do today? I want to surf, soccer, actor, stand up. Mom. Yeah, and then I want you to fund all my <laughs> bad decisions and also laugh at everything and have a great personality. I want to go to the yes. Olive Garden and slash Magianos. What does that mean? Uh, yeah, I can't with this. It's, it's yeah. like, there's right. like there's like a Next. pit in my throat. Yes. Uh, uh, that girl right there. Nah, nah, sh- please, just just some short answers, please. Yeah, none. Well, we did girl. this already. Did we? Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, yeah. Did oh, we, we did. We did this, didn't we? Oh wait, no. No, no, we haven't. Okay. No, yeah. no, no. no. She, she sent it to me. Yes. Okay. Okay. Hello, Nash. Nash. What's up? Um, good. Like serious? No. Yes. It, she looks like a runaway, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're right. This does look like she a, looks like she's like it looks like a hotline an ad for yeah. like trafficking. One eight hundred. Watch out for men. Yeah. Yeah. It does. Ad for yes. trafficking is perfect. Yes. <laughs> so you could save Nash. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It's the side of a bus stop. <laughs> ass face. <laughs> for real. <laughs> and Nash, you seem very nice. I just don't know why. Yeah. What if I told you I have the same astrological chart as future? Um, um, nobody gives a fuck. <laughs> but it's kind of a fun. Yeah. I want we're, you, we're, we're, your actual personality before yes. I get uh, weird, cute shit like yeah, this. Weird, yeah, exactly. Give me something you like before I get this. So, I mean, maybe someone will be like, you're toxic? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> right. Let's see. So it said she's looking for a long-term relationship, but open to short. Fun. What is that? What is it that? It means down for no, 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 short no, no, if you're cool enough. The, the photo of? Oh, oh. Some, it looks like some Indian guy. Um, Wait. It's like an advertisement for something, a flyer. Is that money? It's weird. Yeah, it's weird. Um, but I, I kind of, the photo, if I knew what it was, I could be it's like, also, very, your nails are kind of cool with the blue at the end. No, no, she looked good in this. She yeah, yeah, good. yeah. It's kind of sick. She you kind of, yeah, even though it's not money, it gives off the vibes of like, I got money, bitch. It's cute. It's cute. Um, I like keep it. Keep going. Oh, this I is love great. it. This yeah. great. I love it. Every First, brown girl on Hitch got to have that wedding photo. Yeah. Slay in. Yeah. That looks good. She looks great. The unusual skills, bro zoning oh, men I'm actually interested in. Shit, ah, I, I hate this one. Okay, yeah. No, but I mean, well, you shouldn't be... Te- maybe. Okay, I'm happy you're putting this so we know, but you shouldn't tell other people you're trying to date that you're good at this because... This is a media turnoff. Yes. Because no dude wants to deal with this ever. Yeah, no ever. guy wants to go into it being like, oh, she might put me in the bro category. Two, two things that... Dudes are mostly cool with all jokes. Unless they're like weak, but the main things that all dudes kind of hate is the bro, like the fake bro zoning and like um, bad jokes where they say it's just a joke, babe. It's like that was a bad joke. You know what I'm saying? Like when they're roasting yeah. you badly. Yeah. So they're like, let me have my jokes, and you're like, these aren't even good jokes, good and you're just being mean, right? Yeah. So these are the two things. Yeah. Or when that someone's like, uh, he's just like my brother. And oh you're like, God, I, I want to die. I cannot. <laughs> well, I, yeah, well, I guess I want to fuck my sister. I guess, yeah. I'm, I guess <laughs> I'm from Alabama now. <laughs> yes. You know what I'm saying? Um. Yeah, don't put that. I'm happy you said that to us. Yeah. Stop doing that. Yeah. Um, this is a cool angle for a photo. <laughs> you like are you're kind of cool, good yeah. at taking I like, photos from I different like angles. Uh, we don't really know what you look like, but it's You can tell tight. that she's bi just from the angles. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know you're bi. I can feel it. I go crazy for any sport that's my current that my current crush is into. That's so, okay, so you just care what your 
crushes into. That's what I'm getting. Well, I, I don't. I don't know you yet. I have nothing about you. Yeah, Nash. We don't know anything about Where you. Where are you? Keep, what are you doing? Going down. You look pretty here. This yeah. could be your first photo. She it's looks still like a goddamn a, it's refugee. Still a dude. Little. <laughs> she looks like she's on the run from the Taliban, dude. She does. Don't dude. do that, Malala. <laughs> dude, it's Malala vibes. That's. I know this hijab. Trust me. Listen. Every old ass mom got this hijab. Has on. This hijab Just yeah. the one little thing. Boom. No. Yes. That's the mom hijab the style. Morality police Stop. Would not like that. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> The Mossad yeah. are fucking after you, bitch. I, look, it's not, yeah. It's and then like a photo legit at fifty degrees <laughs> with a fucking projects in the back. Yeah, Nash, you got to change basically all these photos. Um, <laughs> no, no, no. You got, some of them are fun. Uh, I like. No, the, you can't do the trafficking one. Yeah, this one is good. That's cute. And this one's second, cool. Second one, third one's this cute. one's good as well. Yeah. So the second and the third one are good. And the other one though, and the room is kind of cool. Um, the room room. Okay. It is cool, but you have to then have every other photo be yeah. fire. So yeah. your last two and your first one need to change. What is that? Let's see you smile or just get more of your personality. Yeah. And then for your answers, they- No, they, no, but here's the There's some body in that. That's not bad. You see some body? I mean, but dude, you could get so much better than that. Just I in terms so. of like, like just a good also, it's photo like a, of it's her. Like gloomy day. It's a gloomy like, day. Makes me feel it, sad at the I, end. I also don't know what she's doing. It's like, did Zack Snyder take oh, this Oh, is that on the- uh, a uh, tennis court? Yeah. Oh, there's a racket. Dude, yeah, yeah. I thought that was like a camel back. Oh. It's so, it's such a weird angle. I didn't know what it was. Oh. That was a desert photo. Yeah. Um. Yeah, okay. So, what's for all your answers, just actually know who you are. Yeah, nothing about you. And, um. yeah, the, uh, the future thing is, the only thing I know from the future answer is that you have an Android. That's the yes. only thing I know because <laughs> of the emoji you used. Uh, <laughs> like okay she has an intro dude uh also like you're cute let's see it more. yeah you know it's exactly you're cute be confident in it put it out there yeah we like it we want to see we want to know who you are that's what we always want to know with 100%. all of these profiles is like who, who are, are you? you put it out there show it the fucking oh my god the refugee auntie jesus christ <laughs> you have to do the refugee auntie style Oh my God. Oh, <laughs> uh, guys. But remember to send in your updates. We love getting those. Yes. And um, send in your questions. And it's love, man. We're not trying to shit. We're just hanging out. We're trying a to help. Time yeah. Just, I, I, I remember I told yeah. a, a friend, I was like, oh, yeah, um, on our show, we review hinge profiles. Yeah. And she was like, oh, you do random? Like, that's so mean. And I go, no, 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 no. We do them because we want to help these yeah, people. Yeah, of course. We never go like, Go into it being like, let's make fun of this person. Even that one dude, remember the, the, oh, yeah. the tall guy yeah. with all the photos from above? <laughs> like, I forget his name. The entire time we were like, bro, dude, there's, we want to help you. There's so many fun. We ones. weren't just yeah. like, you suck. Yeah. Because also, then the hinges would be three seconds long. You suck. This hinge, <laughs> you this suck. hinge blows. Next. It's interesting how everyone has a different way they suck. Yes. You know, one of them would have the same belt in every, in every photo. Remember yeah. that? It was like, the what? The same belt, one? yes. It's so weird. Or Nikita is just like, we don't even know if this is real or not. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right, so, sweet. Why do you guys podcast at gmail.com? Yeah. Send in your hinge profiles, send in your questions, go to our link trees, click on those form submissions, give us questions like we did today about the arranged marriage. Yes. And um, besides that, just keep listening and tell a friend. Oh, rate and review the show, guys. Um, Get into it. Yeah. And uh, subscribe on YouTube and uh, Spotify and Apple Podcasts, all those places. All those places are good because that gets more people to see the show and to listen, etc. We will be back next week. Thank you for listening. Love y'all. Bye. Bye.